40 seconds in this country, someone has a stroke, but the more important number to remember, 80% of strokes are actually preventable. ABC Action News reporter Lydia Vasquez explains what doctors are reminding everyone to look out for. I'm left-handed, so now I have to do everything right-handed, and my uh, my my left side is uh, not not as normal. In 2017, Chuck Coward tells me he felt off. My whole left side was like really numb. Coward suffered an ischemic stroke. He had slurred speech and numbness. Two signs people should look out for: B for balance, E for eyes, F for face, A for arms. S for speech and T for time. If you have a, any kind of dysfunction in any of those things, you have to be worried about a stroke. I asked Dr. Michael Sanders what people should do if they think they're experiencing any of those symptoms. Get to the hospital as soon as you can. A lot of people think, well, I want to wait a little bit and see if this kind of goes away on its own. Dr. Sanders tells me in a time people are under a lot of stress, it's important to get frequent checkups and pay attention to your body. Stress leads to high blood pressure. People who have extremely high blood pressure are at risk for hemorrhagic stroke and for bleeding in their brain. So I think um, blood pressure control is really important. Dr. Sanders says medication and things like yoga and a healthy lifestyle can reduce the risk of stroke, also limiting caffeine, smoking, and alcohol. For Coward, he says he's thankful he went to the emergency room when he did. I survived the stroke, and my doctor told me I may not be able to walk again, but look at me now. You know, I may not, I may, I may not be able to run a marathon, but I'm walking at least a little bit. In Tampa, Lydia Vasquez, ABC Action News.